Hi everyone, it's Tammy and I am so excited to finally, it feels like finally, get my pre-order from Stampin' Up. Some demonstrators have had theirs for almost a week now. Some have had it for even longer if they were able to go to the on-stage um, convention that Stampin' Up has, but I was not able to go to that. Honestly, I was so new, I didn't even know what that is, and I'm still kind of not exactly sure, other than I know that they do awards and make and takes and some fun stuff, so maybe one of these times I'll go. I think they've even released the places that they're going to do it, like, not the big one, but like, they do little ones. Okay. I am dying to see the new catalog, and I don't know if it's in here. Because this did not seem heavy enough to have the catalog. So, some of this stuff is older stuff and some of it is the new stuff. So, I'm going to put this on the ground, I think, and then I will pull up. But here's a sneak peek. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Okay, so I'm just going to pull things out and show you. This one is foam ad adhesive strips. I know this doesn't seem very exciting, but you can see how thin they are. This is perfect for shaker cards or for like those skinny pieces that you need to have lifted and you just can't figure out how to do it with the dimensionals. I mean, you have to cut them up or whatever. And these you can still cut, but they come in long strips and you get two um, sheets of them. And I'm very excited about it for shaker cards, especially. <laughs> So without any further ado, let's talk about the new in colors, shall we? Three. Oh my word. Okay. These two are going to be my favorite. I think Flirty Flamingo and Dapper Denim. And then we have Sweet Sugar Plum, Emerald Envy, and Peekaboo Peach. So those are all beautiful colors. I like how they all kind of go together. The Sweet Sugar Plum is kind of a light purple pinkish color. This is kind of a, the Flirty Flamingo is definitely pink, but it's not, at least from what I can see, it's not so, so bright pink, but we'll play with it and see. The Dapper Denim is very denim colored. Emerald Envy is quite emerald um, here. Here's the Cucumber Crush, and here's the Emerald Envy, so you can see that it is more emerald. And then the Peekaboo Peach, I don't know that they've had one like this for a while, and from what I understand from other demonstrators, it's kind of got a little controversy. Actually, it's very close to the Peach Parfait that we had a few years ago. I've never been a demonstrator before, but I was a purchaser for many years, and you know some of the pads I still have. And it is very close to that. This is a little darker. So yeah, these are the new in colors that will be in for two years. And there's Japanese on here. Kind of neat. I don't think that those are on the other ones. No. English, France, or French, Dutch, and Japanese. They took off the Spanish. Well, that's funny. Huh. How about that? All right, so those are the new in colors. Very exciting. Very exciting. And new ribbon. I only got two colors and I got the two colors that I thought that I would use the most and I got the Flirty Flamingo and the Dapper Denim and these are ruched. They are called ruched ribbon and um, yeah, ruched ribbon and let's just see how this looks because it looks fabulous on the, in the catalog. Not that I've even seen the catalog in hand. I've only looked at it online. And I don't think that they're in here, but oh my, isn't that nice? So it's just very pretty. It's like they're already ruffled a little bit. Very nice. I like that a lot. And it feels like you get a ton of ribbon. So it looks like you get 10 yards. So that's 
quite a bit of ribbon. So I'm sure when I do my in color club for these colors, I will definitely include a share of ribbon because this ribbon is very nice. Very pretty. I like those a lot. Okay, so this is from last. Oh, this is new. It's a new stamp. Whoops, and it's already open. Not opened, but it's sprung open. So, how do I get into it? Is it this end? No, it's this end. This is called the Sprinkles Punch. And you can see that it makes sprinkles. That would be fabulous to go inside a shaker card. Now, again, I have heard some controversy on this too because people are saying that it's too big because it wastes a lot of room between each piece and that it just gives you sprinkles. Well, that's what it's for. It's a sprinkle card and I thought it would be nice. Honestly, I expected for the shaker cards, you could use it for confetti or whatever, but I really liked it for the shaker cards because I end up, you know, trying to find other stuff to put inside when this would be a lot less expensive in the long run to use paper. And you could use it with the glitter paper or the, you know, designer series paper or even just plain colored paper. It would be pretty. And you could stamp, you could cut, punch it and then turn it a little bit and punch it again. And because it is sprinkles, it doesn't really matter if you don't get all of it in one or whatever. That's the way I figure it anyway. You know me, I'm frugal, so I try to find ways to use stuff, and I think that this will be just fine. I'm excited about it. And I got some of the Baker's Twine, the thick Baker's Twine. This is in Melon Mambo, and I think that this is new for this catalog. I'm pretty sure. And I just really like this thick Baker's Twine. You can see I've used a bunch of my peach, of my, uh, I think this is Blushing Bride. So, yeah, that I've used a ton. So I knew I'd like this color, so I went ahead and got that. And I got this. It's a project kit, perfectly wrapped project kit. And it makes all of these different kinds of wrapping. So it makes these cute little bags and these boxes and these bags and these boxes. So boxes and bags. And let's see, what does it say? One set. Do you guys want me to open it? What? Yeah? You'd love for me to open it? Well, okay then. Here we go. <laughs> so it looks like these are the bag handles. And we get some clippies and some twine, some glitteries. Ooh, and you get these little clips that are open. Those are kind of pretty. And all of this is sealed. Oh, okay. so here are the striped boxes. Oh, those are cute and those are a good size. So we can just push those in, push this down, push this in. Oops, I pushed it too hard. There we go. So that's a nice size box, and I'm sure that, you know, how many do you get? One, you get four of these, and then this one is very cute with the polka dots, and that has, it's plastic, but you do the top and the bottom, so it has a lid. One, two, three, four of those. You have these, which I'm not sure exactly what you do with these. These might be the lid to these. I bet it is. Oh, I bet it is. That's cute. 
that's real cute. If that's right. And if it's not right, then it's real cute anyway. Oh, and there's little, these cellophane bags. And then here's things to make everything. I bet these are the big bags. So here's some uh, tags, like uh, there's a circle tag, and then these two clip tags. Looks like you get plenty of those, and plenty of these circle dots that are very gold and very pretty. And what are these? You get these things. Oh, I think that these go. Here's the thing. Yes, those go inside the cellophane bags. So that's cute. And it looks like those, like this is the way you do those. And then, so these are like really fast ways to wrap. Then you get these, which so they made cute little things with. See how they made the the like the streamer with the gold dots, and then with these they made little like a bunting. Super cute. Super cute. And then here are the things to make the big bag. So you get four of everything. I don't know what this is quite yet. Oh, this is this stuff. Isn't that cute? Oh my word. And then, let's see. I don't know if you get the stuff to make the flowers or not. Or if I just missed it. Bunting, those things. These things. Hmm. Well, you do get the stuff, it looks like. You do get the stuff to make the flowers and the bows. I just must not know what that is, but I don't see anything that that's, that's that color. Do you? Well, I wonder if I'm missing it. I wonder if that's ever happened. I don't know. Well, that's interesting. So let's see, let me, now I'm confused. Your kit includes gift bags, boxes and tags, die cut accents and stickers, gold foil stickers, macaroon cotton paper trim, white and black baker's twine, gold binder clips, emerald envy paper clips, or clothespins. Additional product projects needed. Perfectly wrapped stamp set, emerald envy, mint macaroon, peekaboo peach, tangerine tango classic stamp pads, basic black pad, fast fuse, and mini dots. So I don't know. Slide the designer series bag into the cellophane bag. A symbol flower. Cross and adhere two petal pieces and curl petals slightly. I don't know. I don't I'm not thinking I got those for some reason. Unless I'm just totally crazy. Maybe I'm missing it. Unless these are petals somehow. I just don't know how they would be. Well, I might have to call Stampin' Up and see what's going on. I've not had to call them on anything yet, so I'm not upset. 
I'm just confused because I don't think I got it. So anyway, I'm sorry. I don't mean to take up the whole time. I'm just now trying to find it. And I don't think I got at it. So I will call them and I'm sure they will rectify that post haste. Because I know I don't have anything that looks like bows or flowers that can be made out of anything in this kit. But it is a very cute kit. I am excited to use it anyhow. And worst case scenario is I could figure it out and make something on my own, just that it's all supposed to be in this little kit. So I'm sure they'll fix it. But that is that, and that is very cool. I will leave this out so that I won't forget to call them. And then, let's see. This is something I got. I don't want to show you guys too much too soon because I want to do it together. This is that. This is that. I just got some Whisper White, so that's not new. These are new. These are new. Oh, look. Perfectly wrapped cardstock die. So here it is. It just came separately. Yay. Okay, so there's that. I don't have to worry about that after all. And this. And affectionately yours. In color. In color. Okay. So... I got the Affectionately Yours cardstock, which is, I don't know what colors. Looks like it's the Dapper Denim. Looks like Mint Macaroon, maybe. And is that Watermelon Wonder? Yes, I think it is. So I have Watermelon Wonder, da um, Dapper Denim, and Mint Macaroon in this stack. It's called the Affectionately Yours Cardstock Stack. And this is the In Color Papers. Goodness. So I have the, let's see if I can remember them all, Peekaboo Peach, uh, Dapper Denim, Flamingo Oh, it's not Flamingo Pink. Okay, so this is Peekaboo Peach. And then we have... Oh, what is this one called? I'm just going to take them all out. <laughs> Peekaboo Peach. We're well, starting over. Uh, Flirty Flamingo. I don't remember. I'm going to have to look. Sweet Sugar Plum. Emerald Envy. And Dapper Denim. Very nice. I like those colors a lot. And let's go ahead and do these two paper stacks. And this one is, oh, just, I got two of the end colors. So that's the end color again. And this one is the Playful Palette. And this one has, oh, I can never remember the name of this one. Sweet Sugar Plum. It has Flirty Flamingo and the Very Vanilla. Look at me, I knew those. Sweet Sugar Plum, Flirty Flamingo, Very Vanilla. So yes, that's those three. I think, oh, that's not Flirty Flamingo, that's Bashful Bride. All right, so let's do this again. Sweet Sugar Plum, Bashful Bride, Very Vanilla. Very pretty. And that's the Playful Palette. And then I have this Playful Palette. This is the Designer Series paper stack that is six by six. And it is very artistic and it kind of reminds me of the 80s. So there's a few sheets of each and they're front and back. 
And honestly, when I saw this in the catalog, I wasn't crazy about it, but I kind of think that it's going to grow on me. And I think that people are going to love it when they see some of the things that you can do with it. So yeah, it is pretty cool. Now that I see it in person, I like it better. Very nice. So the colors that match this are Basic Black, Blushing Bride, Emerald Envy, Peekaboo Peach, Sweet Sugar Plum, and Very Vanilla. So that's what that other pack went with, and this is that. And this goes along with this Painter's Palette stamp set. And isn't this cute? This is, I, I think you could do so much with just even just those. Um, but this, Shaker Cards, oh my word. Or you could put a picture in here, send it to grandma, or whatever. I love the little push pin. And it says, our friendship is a work of art. Your idea to have a birthday was simply a stroke of genius and a little expression of love. So very cute, very versatile. I just really like this. I, I'm really kind of... This was the one that I was like, oh, I'll get it because I think it's going to be a hit and I can see that there's some things to do with it. But at first I couldn't come up with anything. But now that I'm seeing it, I'm coming up with some good ideas. So yay. I like that. Oh, I am very excited about this one. This is called Pop of Paradise. And it has thinking of you. And it has hello, thank you, and a very special day. And it has this really cute flamingo. that That's the whole reason I got it. And, and I don't know, but for some reason, pineapples are coming in and they have this pineapple. They have a big pineapple that's probably about this big and it's just a pineapple. And the more I look at the catalog and see that, the more I'm like, oh, I think I might want that. I don't know. I would not have picked it, but now I'm kind of liking it. And um, I haven't even seen it in person, nor have I seen the catalog in person. And I do not have a catalog in here, so I still... I didn't get any of my catalogs, so those are still coming, I am sure. They better be here tomorrow, or I'm going to be upset. <laughs> now, this goes along with this. This is a bundle. So they still do offer bundles, but they are going to be a little, you know, different. Like, this is the Swirly Scribbles Thin Lit Dies with the Swirly Bird stamp set. Now, this alone looks kind of, I don't know. I mean, it looks cute, and it looks like there's a lot that you can do with it. At least that's what I see when I first see it, but it looks like a lot of moving parts, and I'm going, okay, is this just a sailboat? What? I mean, because I can certainly see a sailboat if I look at that. But And there's a little flag even, but I wasn't really sure what else. But there's a nest with some eggs and a bird, and I think that we'll be able to make lots of different things with that. And here is the cute die cuts that go along with it, and I'm super excited about these. Aren't these cute? So I can totally see this being a nest or I can even do an outline to a card and something like this. I just thought that these were really cool and I can see lots of different fun things going on with that bundle. So this might be a bundle that you might wanna pick up. I know I was excited about it and I will probably be doing some things with this first. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what I wanna use first because I like it all. These are the, now we told you, well I told you, that those circle thinlets and the square thinlets were going away and the oval thinlets and I couldn't believe it and I thought that they would have something else and when I got a sneak peek of the new catalog I was able to see these and now I'm going to see them in person and let's see, oh boy. Okay, so instead of having all of those punches that are scalloped, they now have, and they have these in circles and in hearts. They're very cute. I don't think the hearts have scallops. I don't know, they could. But I only bought the squares to start. And they like come in like pairs. So like this one will fit inside this one. And then this one will fit inside that one. And that one will fit, you know, it like they work together so that you can make shaker cards. You, and I think that that's kind of what they're going for. I'm not positive, but they've kind of geared a lot of things shaker cardy. But I bet there's even one that fits into this palette. I didn't even think of that, but I'm sure that there is. So yeah, you could fit one of these squares right into that palette and make it, or that 
easel and make it just per fit perfectly. So very cool. I'm excited to use those. <clears throat> then I have two more things. Yay! And then I can get started in making something. Oh my goodness. Oh. Hedgy hogs! And this is a hostess set. So this hostess set you're only allowed to get if you host a party or if you purchase enough stuff to make your own party and which would be $150. So if any of you guys are interested in getting the stamp set, let me know and you can either do a party by gathering some of your orders from your friends or you can order, you know, maybe a bunch of stuff from the catalog and work it up yourself so that you can get this for free. This is one of the only times that I know that demonstrators are even allowed to purchase these. So we have to purchase them at full price. So we don't get them for free, but I'm not a hostess either. So I just purchased this with my pre-order and was able to get this at full price, but um, which I still don't think was very much, but it's still awesome. I mean, it was great. They still have, even though it's full price, it's a discounted price and it has the hedgehogs. I had to get it. We're allowed to get two hostess st stamp sets. I only got one because I was trying to save my money a little bit because you can see I went a little crazy. But I loved this frog, I loved the elephant, and of course I loved the hedgehogs. They're just too darn cute. And I am just so excited about these. Oh my word. So excited. So yeah, this might be the first stamp set that I have to use. Oh, I just love it. And then this, oh no, I lied, there's two more things. That's right, so this is affectionately yours. This is a designer series paper pack. And it is going to be fabulous, I have a feeling. Let's see it. Okay, so there's this, which is, oh, and I need to keep that out so I can tell you what colors. Crumb Cake, Cucumber Crush, Daffodil Delight, Mint Macaroon, Night of Navy, Watermelon Wonder, and Whisper White. So this is Night of Navy. Yeah, I guess it does look darker than that. So there's this one, and then on the other side is that pretty mint macaroon, I believe, with the crumb cake. And then there's this one that's really cute. Oh, I really like that. And on the back is this, very pretty. With the, um, This is Watermelon Wonder with the crumb cake. This one is the Night of Navy with the crumb cake. And then on the other side, it has mint macaroon and delightful, no, daffodil delight with the crumb cake. And then here's a sheet that's similar to the first one that we saw, but a little different. And on the back, it's that design. And I know we have some good stuff coming up here, people. And then this one has the Cucumber Crush with the crumb cake. And it's flower pattern. Hopefully you can see that. It's very pretty. And then this is the, uh, let's see, Must Be Watermelon Wonder with the crumb cake. Doesn't look as bright as Watermelon Wonder. It just must be subdued from the way that it looks. Okay, here we go. This one has... A peak of the copper. Do you see these foiled copper? Copper is one of the new in colors. Not in color, in colors, but it's in. It's a color that is in, and we will be offering copper embossing powder. So I'm excited about that too. And it looks like the back of that is just white, and you only get one sheet of that. And then it looks like we get one sheet of this one as well, which is beautiful. It's like the crumb cake and the copper. Oh my word, it's very pretty. But you only get one sheet of that too, so we're gonna have to use those frugally. I won't be using a whole piece of that with something. Those are beautiful. So I am excited about that. And this one I think is going to be my favorite. This is called Pop of Pink. The colors are Melon Bombo, Whisper White, and Basic Black. So we start out with basic black and white, very pretty, kind of does a woo on your eyes. 
But on the other side is this. Oh, I love it. And here is some black polka dots with the other side. Oh, they're cute little hearts. Oh, I can so see that for Valentine's Day or for an anniversary card. Oh, my word. And then the next one, if I can get these off, are little diamonds and pink polka dots or white polka dots on the pink. And then this is really cute, black and white chevron with black and white triangles or black and pink triangles on a white background. Oh my word, I love this next one. The black and white stripes which matches this box. Oh, in the back of that are these cute little dots. And then are you seeing what I'm seeing? Oh, these gold foiled on white polka dots. So again, you get one sheet of that. And then one sheet of the, looks like gold sprinkles on white. Oh my word, those are so pretty. Okay, so yeah, that's why they call it a pop of pink, I suppose. Because it's mostly black and white, but there's definitely pink. Well, that is beautiful. Okay, so that is everything that I've gotten. I hope that you like the new in colors. I hope that you like the new stuff. I can't wait to show you some new projects. And I'm going to close now so I can get started making something. I'm super excited. Thanks for watching, guys. And you guys will be able to order from the catalog starting June 1st. If you'd like a catalog, please let me know. I will just charge you shipping to get it out to you. Or if you place an order that's $50 or more, you can get it for free. Or if you join one of my clubs, you can also get it free. So please look for that information below. And I'm excited. Happy shopping. And remember, if you want the Hostess kit, you can order $150 worth of stuff and this could be yours for free and it's adorable my 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 thanks guys bye bye